Hey YouTube, this is Dre OM. I'm here to do a hair video. I actually just realized that it is Thursday, so I will be doing a controversy talks. And um, that'll be nice because I'm not on a web series, which has been a while since I haven't been doing a web series while I've been doing that. Um, but I do have an interesting, well, many interesting topics to talk about, so it won't be boring, hopefully. Um, unless I make it that way. But the topic won't be boring. So, um, if you've been following me on Tumblr, sometimes I've been doing styles and I've been posting pictures. And I've been posting pictures before I do videos. Um, and this style particularly, uh, I post a picture first just because, um, I don't know if you guys can see, but I have lock knots here, so I wanted to do a curl with it, but I didn't want I want I didn't want to make two videos, so I just figured I'd show you guys it with the lock knots and without. Also, I know you guys have been saying that sometimes you can't hear my videos. Um, I really don't know what's been happening. I feel like I've been talking the exact same since uh, I've been filming them from home to here to whatever. Um, as you guys can see, I'm in my dorm room right now. But I don't know why it's doing that. But I did notice that when I would play them back, they were really, really, really low. So I really apologize for that. Um, I just didn't have time to remake the entire video. I really, really hope that this is going to be loud enough because it's not. I'm going to be like, ugh. And um, I'm going to have to figure out what the heck is going on because I have no idea. I haven't changed any settings to, like, take into a different um, microphone or anything. So I don't know. Um, I'll... I'll if if it doesn't work then I'll try and check this out but for right now I'm gonna show you guys my mohawk style and I actually feel like I'm dressed like a rock star right now cuz I got the vest on red jeans <laughs> I don't have any super rock star shoes on I was going to wear my um, high top converse my like really long converse but I might no no it's too much these kids aren't gonna be able to handle it no I think I will. I think I will put them on. If I have time to, after this video and before breakfast, I'm going to put them on. Um, so, anyways, let me show you guys the style. So, what I did was I parted my hair into three parts. Um, two parts on this, on one part on each side, and then the part in the middle to see how much hair I wanted in the middle. Um, the sides actually took a while because I wasn't sure exactly what I wanted to do, but in the end I had to do something simple. And what I did was I just flat twisted my hair up. So as you guys can see, there's flat twists all the way, even way down here there's a flat twist. And it's the same thing on this side. Um, and I've got a lot of compliments for this hairstyle, which I, I mean, I like compliments, but I, for some reason, wasn't expecting as many as I got. Um, so I had that going on, my flat twist going up. And then I put all the hair in the middle into lock knots. Um, okay, so these are all little knot lock knots right here. That's why my hair looks so short. Um, and then I took the ends of my flat twists from the sides and I rolled them down. So I kind of technically flat twisted them. Um, they were a little difficult because some of them were too short or too long. Well, not too long, but too short. And so I had to use a lot of pins. But, um... I flat twisted, well, I rolled the ends down, and here's a pin sticking up right here. Um, okay. And then at the end, I actually ended up braiding it so that it was a little secure at the end, and then I flat twisted this side down and braided it here. Um, and then with the braided ends, I kind of like hooked them underneath each other and pinned them up. So as you guys can see, it goes down. So that's all that I did for that. Um, you might be able to find a better way. I tried to braid it because, but then it ended up the braids kind of stuck out and there was like a gap. So that looked really weird. Um, so that's the style. I'll show you guys one more time. Here's the front. Side. Back. Angle from the side. Angle from the front. Angle back from the front. Always so weird doing that, <laughs> um, because I just imagine people like looking like, oh, okay, okay, um, okay. So now I'm gonna take out my lock knots, and it's gonna be so excited. Be right back. Okay, so I'm back. Um, 
trying to get the last few lock knots out, but I also just don't have time to take them all out and then be like, oh, cool, and then make the video and blah, blah, blah. So, I'm just going to show you guys how it is right now. Excuse my hair on the side. The side wants to be all done now that I um, took the middle off. But, um, it gives it a fuller look. As you guys can see, the curls are here. Um, it makes it look a little bouncy. Makes it look a little longer. Um, obviously just an overall different look. Um, I'm going to show you guys the back in a tad bit. A few seconds. I'm pretty sure that's not all of them, but I actually don't feel anymore. So, this is the front. Um, it's kind of hanging down. Not necessarily. Um, here's it from the side. So that's about it. Um, it's very easy once you figure out how you're going to put it up in the side. And just like I told, well, just like I said in my how to create your own style video, I was just like, oh, I want my hair in a mohawk. Oh, it'd be cool if I did lock knots in the middle. And I went from there. Um, so that's how I got this idea. Jeez. The side is really out of control right now. Um, but yeah, so very sim fairly simple, um, kind of cool style to try and do later on in life. <sighs> and I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you guys could see well enough. Um, and there will be some pictures on Tumblr to follow up with this video. Alright, thank you guys for watching. Check out Controversy Talks in a little bit later on today.